Hi, and thank you for watching this video about Tellius. Tellius augments the analytics experience for business users, analysts, and data experts by enabling them to explore their data more quickly and extract maximum value out of their data. Users can ask questions about their data using natural language search to get answers in the form of visualizations, conduct root cause analysis using automated insights, and enable forward-looking predictions using our machine learning capabilities. In this video, I'll demonstrate how our automated insights can demonstrate the factors that contribute most to customer churn and produce a vizpad like this that identifies customers most likely to churn so that your business users can take action. Let's first recap how most businesses solve this challenge today. Customer churn analysis typically involves business analysts either configuring data in an application like Excel or partnering with data experts to pull data from various locations, communicate relevant business context, and build models to get any meaningful insights. This process is too manual, includes lots of disparate applications, and is very time consuming, limiting the value of your results. Tellius provides end-to-end -end analytical capabilities creating a unified experience for all of your business and data teams. In this customer churn use case, the data we have on our customers includes demographic attributes, subscription information, product usage, and support tickets. These data sets often come from separate sources, which our system can handle with ease. We have lots of connectors that make loading data quick and simple, and our data transformation layer has a no-code user interface while also providing flexibility for advanced users who want to leverage Python and SQL code. Let's use the SQL transform to create a flag to identify which customers we retain, which we'll define as customers who we've received payment from in the last three months. Once you've finished preparing the data, you can combine multiple data sources into a single business view for your end users to consume for analysis. Now that we have our data ready, we can move on to the front end capabilities of the platform. Let's start with the search feature. Here, users can ask questions in natural language or a Google-like search interface and get answers about their data without writing any code or having to ask data experts for help. Say I'm a product analyst. I may want to look at the retention rate by different product types. I can simply ask Telius, show me retention rate by product type, and a chart quickly appears best fit to the criteria that I specified in my search question. It looks like the open plan may be too vague for our customers to keep signing back up with us. If this chart is something I want to track, I can add it to a vizpad along with any other KPIs or visuals that I may want to track at the same time. I may also be interested in knowing how churn has trended over time for a particular product that I personally manage. Now I'll ask, show me retention rate for Acumen monthly in 2020. It looks like we've gotten much better over time at retaining our customers, but there's clearly a lot of opportunity that we've left on the table. My next question may be to look at what factors contribute to churn. So now we'll turn to Tellius's automated insights to help. The key driver insight will tell us what factors in my data contribute to a particular metric or subset of my data. To start, I may wanna know what factors lead to successfully retaining a customer. The insight shows us that customers who have a high training time and the platinum support package are 43% more likely to stay on with us compared to all of our retained customers. I now have something I can offer an at-risk of churn customer. Another useful insight may be to look at the comparison between retained and churned customers so we can run a cohort insight. Notice that our retained customers often have a higher number of training sessions and a better support package through our platinum plan. This additional insight supports what we saw in the previous one and highlights other differentiators as well. We have a set of action items that we can take on these potential churned customers, but now the question is how do we identify who those customers are? Let's utilize the predict module to build a model predicting probability of churn. Fortunately, I don't have to be a data scientist to create models in Tellius. Tellius's AutoML feature compared multiple algorithms to find the one best suited to my classification problem of predicting whether customers will churn or not. I can see the statistics about how that model performed as well as the feature importances and apply this model's predictions to my data set. Finally, I'll take those predictions and rank order the most at-risk customers and present it in an easy to consume vizpad. This vizpad is demonstrating advanced results that would have likely taken weeks to put together across multiple applications if you were not using Tellius and this only took a matter of hours to create inside of the Tellius platform. 
Business users can now share this information with the appropriate stakeholders and account executives to offer additional training sessions and the Platinum support package to customers, perhaps at a discount, ultimately preventing loss of revenue and higher customer satisfaction. As you can see, Tellius improved the process of retention analysis through the use of our data prep, search, insights, and predict capabilities to spot at-risk customers and provide action items to reduce churn via additional training sessions and enhancements to their support packages. Check out Tellius.com to learn more about our platform and to request a demo so we can show you how Tellius can help your business.